My family's always been connected with the island. I've been here for about 40 years. My grandparents um, bought a property across the road in the 1940s. Mark and I have been married for 20 years. He's employed by the mine. He's been at the mine now for 16 years. I guess it was what enabled us to become property owners. So he works four days on, four days off. He leaves home at 6.30 and he'll go into the mine. He's a dredge operator, so he sits in a little box for 12 hours. <laughs> I've got two kids, Nell and Clancy, and um, they've got a most idyllic childhood, they just don't really know how lucky they've got it. The whole bombshell with the Annabelle government um, rocked me into action. I went to a rally in um, Dunwich which was full of miners um, and families and community members who were frightened. It's one of those moments you have in your life where you go, oh bugger. Without that mine wage coming in, we wouldn't have been able to raise the kids and live on Australia. For 14 years, it was our own only source of income. So I opted to um, start a business on Australia, Stradbroke Island of Beth, and um, I set up weddings and parties. Should mining close tomorrow, we might, we might survive. <laughs> I don't know. Tourists are an important part of our lifestyle here. We need them. And no one's opposed to the idea that mining will cease on the island. Everyone's quite comfortable with that idea. But everyone agrees the transition will be pivotal to um, Stratty's next life. There's a real balance to be struck. Um, and I really hope that we always continue to get that balance right. The future of Stratty is a little uncertain. We recently um, surveyed a lot of the youth and I think we interviewed about 50 kids and um, there's probably about three of them who think that they can that they can live here and make a living. I keep suggesting to them that they can take over my business when, when it gets too hard for me. Hopefully my choice has created an opportunity. There's nowhere else in the world that I want to be. You've got no idea how special it is to live in this place and, and, and be part of a community that loves you and cares for you and your kids. And, um, and if it could stay the same, that'd be, <laughs> that would really be the ultimate for me.